so we'll start off with isoflurane. Isoflurane has an oil gas partition coefficient of 98, meaning it's very potent and so has a MAC of only 1. However, it has a comparatively high blood gas partition coefficient of 1.4 and so has a relatively slow onset and offset. Only 0.2% of it is metabolized in the body and none of its metabolites are toxic. In terms of its pharmacodynamics, let's start with cardiovascular effects. It reduces myocardial contractility and also systemic vascular resistance, and so you'll likely notice a decrease in blood pressure and a rise in heart rate. Respiratory effects include a reduction in tidal volume and a compensatory rise in respiratory rate. Neurologically, it increases cerebral blood flow, and as with all volatile anaesthetics, it reduces cerebral metabolic rate for oxygen. Uterine tone is also reduced, which may impact on hemostasis for certain gynecological and obstetric cases.